Welcome back, Connect fam. So whether you need a fresh start for your wardrobe, closet, or your entire life to be changed, our next guest has the answers coming. Please help us welcome to the Connect fam entrepreneur, celebrity stylist, lifestyle coach, contributing stylist, editor, and Honey, she's done a whole lot, and she's going to talk about some amazing things. She's the styling editor also for Santa Santa Barbara magazine, Julie Bogo. Please help us welcome her to the show. Hi, Julie. Welcome. Thank you. So glad to be here. Thank you so much. We're excited to have you. We know you are built with wealth of information and knowledge, so we can't wait to to really pluck some gems from you, if that's okay. You've been a fashion stylist for more than 30 years. Can you tell us a little bit about your story and how you started in the fashion industry? Of course. So I am from New York City, and I will tell you that clothing, fashion, it was just, I was obsessed from the time I was probably three years old. I remember I would have tantrums with my mother. I refused to wear pants or overalls to the park. I wanted to wear my white party dress and my my black Mary Jane's. And, you know, and it's, this is like true story. The minute I put my foot in that plastic Barbie high heel shoe, I was, I was done for, I was a goner. So in my twenties, I started as an image consultant and wardrobe stylist in New York city. And then in the late nineties, I moved out to Los Angeles where my career really took off more in, you know, celebrity styling, A-list, you know, red carpet functions like that. I, I think my first gig, but the truth is, you know, I've been in all areas of the industry. I, I've done, you know, the Hollywood thing. I've done all that, but I also really love working with women. Women is my main focus and their lifestyle, you know, whether they be career women, whether they be moms reinventing themselves, whether they be young women that are going into the work world, and they don't know how to put themselves together. Right now, my brand is very focused on midlife women reinventing themselves, but I really have, you know, I, I can see where, where it's come full circle. My, my passion is empowering women to be the absolute best version of themselves at any stage, at any age, at any weight, at any, you know, whoever, wherever, my goal is to help women look and feel, because we want our lives to feel as good as they look, to look and feel magnificent. So that's a little bit of my history. That's awesome. Well, I wanted to just get to a quick backstory. Uh, Funny enough, after you were scheduled for our show, the producers from Inside Edition also booked you. And so we want uh, to have you just share a little bit about that segment and what you were sharing. That was amazing. That was just, you know, one of the producers reached out to me because they had seen on my social media, on TikTok and on Instagram, I did a whole series on midlife dating, what it's like to be 62 years old in the dating world and online dating. And I did video vlogs, you know, for about a few months there. So because of the Golden Bachelor was such a big thing in the last few months, there's been a lot of exposure to women and men who are in that dating pool. So they reached out to me. And also it was really wonderful because they wanted to know about my life and what I do and, you know, that I'm, yes, I'm, I'm, I'm a businesswoman. And so I had the honor of actually working with the legend Jim Murray. He came out to my home and we had just an incredible experience doing that segment. So that was really fun. Julie, so as an expert and vet in the industry, how would you say that fashion has evolved through the years as, you know, women age and like myself? And so what styles do you recommend for more seasoned women? You know, that's a great question. And I'm really big on not separating out and yet helping, how do I put this? Seasoned women, like I want to step away from that we can't be, you know, sexy, that we can't show skin. You know, I'm really about, and how fashion has changed. Fashion really used to be just for the elite, honestly, you know, very expensive runway pieces. And now it's changed in that it's much more accessible. You know, you see what's called fast fashion retailers like Zara who emulate the high-end designer pieces that you've seen, you know, a few months ago on the runway, they bring it into those stores. So everybody can look fabulous and wear those types of styles. But in terms of signature personal style and aging and what's appropriate, I try to stay away from that. You know, I think we are all able to wear what 
works for us, what makes us feel the best, what's going to make us shine. So if I'm 60 years old and I want to wear, you know, a bikini or a crop top with the high waisted, you know, jeans, I'm going to do it. And I want my clients to do that too. It's so important that we don't fall into that we no longer exist because of a certain age. I love it. So Julie, I know you talked about how you want to make specifically women feel, but I know you work with, with all. So what products and services does your company, Julie Eliza Styling, offer? And how does your virtual styling work for those that are not local? Thank goodness almost that we had COVID because we all had to really step up and figure out how to do our, our services and what we do in a virtual manner. So just like on this call, just like doing anything, I can jump on a Zoom call with the client, get right into her closet, it's almost like we've become besties, like literal, literal girlfriends hanging out. You know, I'm like, grab a glass of wine, grab a, you know, a cup of tea, whatever. And it's seamless, you know, so I can work with clients all over, you know, the United States. I have clients that are in Europe and England, wherever. And so that's amazing. That's like the no brainer. Um, the thing that the product part is really great, too, is in that speaking of what I just mentioned about fast fashion and affordable, what I call luxury for less, I call it bougie on a budget. And that's, <laughs> that's how I started, you know, myself, you know, I, I you know, I grew up pretty poor and I, I, I wanted to put myself, so I would find back in the day, it was called, I think Eileen's basement. And, you know, we would find these retailers that were discounted. So I am an affiliate partner with Amazon and I have a virtual store, an online shopping store that everything is curated by myself, you know, beautiful designer inspired jewelry, you know, like designer inspired watches, designer inspired handbags. Um, so you can get the fashion, you can get the accessories, you can get home goods, you can get beauty. And my clients love to shop that way because the truth is also fashion. Um, it's, it's, you know, they change it up on us every season. This season, it's the color red, right? This is the it color of 2023, 2024. And next year, <laughs> It's going to be something different. So you can shop online and then you can get all of my services. I do signature style coaching with clients all over the world. So Julie, I want to first start by saying, I love that you have confirmed for me that age shouldn't matter in how you dress, because that's a question, you know, that I have to ask myself almost daily because I mean, who doesn't love to be sexy? And then the other is that you're right. We're just in a time now that you know, I want pieces that are, you know, luxury items, but I want more pieces that sometimes that are fast fashion or in between. So you've just confirmed for me that that's okay. So thank you for that. I love it. I love it so much. Anything is possible. Well, thank you so much, Julie, for being here with us today. Can you share with us and just tell our viewers the best way to connect with you? Absolutely. You can find me on Instagram at Julie Liza Styling. You can also email me at julieelizavogel at, at gmail.com. And you can also find me on my website, julieelizastyling.com. I love that. And I got to ask you this last question, Julie. Yeah. How, just because I am speaking, you know, off camera, how has faith played such a big part in, in your growth and just your attitude to, to have that grit and to go forward? Mm -hmm. Has that played a big part for you? It's been the main character part. And, you know, that is, that is something that I will always not only speak about, but I will always, it, it's, it's the way I live my life. It's, it's every door that has ever opened for me is always, I know it has been God that has done it because he has done things that are, he's done the impossible. You know, he's, he's, he's opened things that, that, you know, how that scripture is, you know, I don't, I don't call the equipped. I, I equip the called. Wow. And he has put me in front of people and in and, and situations that, you know, just for instance, I want to say with Natalie, you know, she was in Texas, you know, of all, of, and also in, you know, being on Inside Edition, there are thousands of women in their 60s that are looking for love. And there are, there are millions of people on TikTok. How did these people come to me? How did they, how did they find me? If that's not something who runs, who basically makes the, the waves curl and the sun rise, I don't know what is. And so for that, I give him all that glory. Amen. Faith, faith, faith. There we go, exceedingly abundantly. Thank you so much for being open. And for those who heard the word Nat, 
Big Nat, that's our executive producer. So we love you, Big Nat. <laughs> Thank you so much, Julie, again for hanging out with us. You are a ball of light. God bless you and continue to shine bright. Matthew 514. So stay connected with us, Connect Fam. We will take a quick break. Get your water, get your tea, whatever you need. We're going to be right back with a few ways you can actually get what you want in 2024. Stay close.